everyone welcome back to my channel today we're gonna go over how to install a vinyl siding outside corner vinyl siding outside corner is located at the outside corner of your house but a lot of the times these vinyl siding corner intend to be somewhere close to a, a driveway which a car may hit it it may be where you cut your lawn and then the lawn tractor or some object may hit it so it intend to damage a lot and then the repair on it is not bad at all but people assume that you would have to take off all these sides in here to replace this outside corner not so this here is ranged from about 10 to 20 bucks and the repair on it for labor is not bad at all so i'm going to show you in a couple steps how to um replace this siding this one is damaged at the bottom um at the way bottom so it's kind of rotted out so we're just going to go ahead and take it out but before i do that i want to go ahead and explain to you um the saw that you need to use position of your blade to get it done over here it's a skill saw you could use this to cut a vinyl siding but I want to show you this skill saw is set to be cut wood at this time the teeth is pointing up towards the saw in order to achieve your goal of making a nice clean cut on a vinyl siding you would have to take this blade off which is you want to loosen this nut right here flip the blade over which the teeth is going down when the teeth going down it don't create the friction and it don't um, split the um, the edges of the, the cut when you make it so that's why we flip the blade the blade um, I'm gonna be using um, the chop saw here rather so I'm not gonna take this blade off today but if, if you have a skill saw at home just make sure that you have that blade um, pointing down now this blade in the, in the chop saw I'm gonna go ahead and take it out and flip it over um, for it to make a nice clean cut for that outside corner. Just make sure that when you take these blade out, make sure that the extension cord is unplugged. It's not plugged in for your safety. Just flip the blade, blade, reset it back in. We have um, rotate that blade around, so we're gonna plug this saw in. Now, let's take a look at the, um, the corner over here. Um, the corner on the wall, it's similar to this right here and it have 
of nailing flange right here. So on the wall, it's all nailed into these nailing flange and then the siding go right over it to cover it up. So what we're gonna do is, on the um, corner there, we're gonna rip this outside edge all the way down to the full length. Then what we're gonna do is rip this new piece on the inside corner here all the way down full end and then overlap it um, to replace that corner there. So I'm going to start the process now of ripping that corner out. One side rip, now we're gonna rip the other side. So we just take off the um, existing outside um, um, corner and what we're going to do, we're going to measure and cut the new piece that we're going to put on. ready to cut so now we're going to go ahead and measure and mark it's very windy at this point so we got the mark good practice is always measure twice cut once So now we go with the mark, we're going to go ahead and cut. So you see, a nice clean cut. If we had not flipped that blade over, all of this side here would be all busted up at this point. So now we have this cut, 
we're going to go ahead and rip it down full length to create a V notch right here that go over the existing flange that we have in the wall. So I want to show you where I'm going to place the knife. Um, pretty much I'm placing the knife right here and splice this and we're going to just rip it all the way down full length. the first um, nailing flange piece off the new piece so we're going to go ahead and do the other side install I want to make sure that uh, we have all the inf information that we need so this is a piece of leftover piece of the, of the new corner so what we're going to go ahead what is on the wall is it's very windy up at this point down. so on the wall the corner is like this it have the nailing flange right here and it's all filled up with nails and the siding overlap it so you can't see those nails so what we have done is on the corner over there we rip it down just about right here so what we did was on the on the outside corner we rip it down on the wall what we're going to go ahead and what we did now with the new piece we rip it down here so this gonna overlap the other one There you have it. it was fast and quick and it's not expensive at all to change the outside corner of your um, vinyl siding uh, we're just going to go ahead here now and clean up and i want to thanks everyone for watching my video please subscribe to my channel for more upcoming video thanks everyone